Hi guys, this is Tracy from Lavinia Stamps and we have Jamie Jones back with us. I'm back again, can't keep me away. Um, we're promoting our new stamps which is super, super exciting. Super exciting, yeah, because yeah. they're amazing. Oh. Now, um, we've had a fantastic response uh, for the new stamps, which is always, it gives you a good buzz, doesn't it? it does. To know that, you know, you're doing the right People thing. People like really. what you're yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Um, so, so enjoyed designing this lot. I really, really did. And I'm so glad that everybody feels the same. Really took the creativity. And up another level with really these ones. I think, I think so. Oh, that's nice. I think so. Like I'll give you a five later. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> okay, so we have got a squarely uh, gel press. That's what we're going to be working with today. And we've got new inks. Well, we've got green sleeves, which is the new one, but we're going to be using the old one, which is russet orange, because we're going to be using it to create like um, a bit more of a Halloween pumpkins mm, yeah makes sense. so I want the colors to be nice and light in the background so we can get that lovely detail from the pumpkin carriage so I'm going to start with the green sleeves I'm going to pop that on look at that green the whole way over. That's it's nice. like whoa that is, nice. that is a really super bright green that's your um, kind of green it is it is I do like that kind of green and then I'm going to add a little bit of the orange. Have so you gone over the full gel plate with the green? I've one? kind of blended it out so it's stronger this side. Okay. So the orange ah. I'm going to bring in from this side. Yeah, so I'm yeah. kind of crossed in the middle. Okay. Yeah. And how are you doing mixing the two without any lines appearing on the gel press? Um, just keep blending it, just keep going over it. Okay. Um, and yeah, they're, they're, they're easy blendable. That's why these inks, that's why we design them right. basically for the gel press because the water content in them uh, is very, very low. Yeah. So they don't bee, they don't streak. So they just blend really nicely uh, okay. on the gel press. Uh -huh. So let me just clean that off and then you can have a go with that mm -hmm. while you're doing that something i forgot to do is cut our card so oh, yeah. it's over to you on the camera oh. for a minute oh, i'm scared <laughs> hi guys i'm just gonna cut the card <laughs> <laughs> i'm nervous now so what i'm doing here is just getting up plenty of green sleeves on my braid and we're gonna go on to the into the gel press. Whoa. This. I'm back. Lend me. Oh, okay. There's your card. Thank goodness you're back. Why? <laughs> I almost got lost. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Right, and then go with your orange. Brilliant. Okay. Just blend it out. Nice. Yeah. Good. Pop your brayer over there. And then uh, I've got the fan brush here, just with water. And all I'm going to do is just. Oh gosh, yeah, you always struggle with this, oh, don't you? Oh, yeah, here we go. I'm just going <laughs> to. I'm just flicking the water over the gel press. So tiny little spatters. So take off a lot of the water, the main... yeah? And then just bring those over. Okay. I'm putting quite a bit on because um, I want the color to be, the background to be quite sort of fluid. I don't want it to be too um, organic, if okay. that kind of makes sense. So plenty on of fine drops. Yeah. Hey, look, I'm getting better at this. Yeah, you are. If I remember correctly, I think you took to bashing the handle on the end. Oh, that, yeah. Didn't you? Which was just another way, because I know some people do struggle with doing yeah. that. So you can't actually use I'll give a little probably light that one. Sure, okay. Yeah. That won't be too heavy. No. Then. Oh, what's going on me? Ok, 
okay? Think, yeah, I, I think, think so. That was good. On cause... there, isn't there? I think so. Right, so I think this time, just to make sure that I get the card central, I'm going to put the card down first. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to turn the gel press over the top. I'm going to line that up. Oh, no. What are you doing? Nothing. <laughs> that always worries me when you say that. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, I forgot that. I'd... Forgot that you'd what? Nothing. Oh, no. It's okay. It's savable. It will be okay. I mean, you can put these onto an acrylic block if you wanted to. If um, you wanted a firmer grip on it. There you go. Absolutely fine. I think it's fine. Mine hasn't actually got any orange left on it. I don't know what I've done with mine. <laughs> <laughs> but. Anyway, I'm not worried about that. We'll build that up. Okay. Yeah? Is that on? And do I, how hard do I need to press on this? Um, like. Just make sure it's completely covered. Let's do that and now take it off. Yeah, just pick it up. That's it. Oh, nice. It is nice, actually. Look at the difference. Very different. Very different. Look at the difference in that. And that, I tell you why, because I've put more water on. And that's oh. that's the effect that you get. Less water, more water. And that's all it is. Oh. Yeah. It just shows how much like what one colour can change to be like so different. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'm gonna dry this off. It's like a bit of brush, isn't it? Do you want a blast? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> We're having a blast. We're having a blast. We always have a blast. We always do. We're, We're happy crafters, aren't we? Around. I might go that way, actually. With a pumpkin there in the orange bit. Nice. It might look better in the green, though, because it might get taken up by the... Oh, actually, it's like grass and then an orange sky. Okay, that's absolutely fine. Right, I'm going to ink up my pumpkin carriage here in Nocturne. Do you like this one? The pumpkin carriage? Yeah. Oh, it's one, I think it's my, one of my favourites. With, with all the customisable things on it as well, like oh, that you yeah. brought out with the... Yeah, which is what we're going to show you today, how to build up the uh, pumpkin. So but just on its own, it even still looks... Oh, I don't know, yeah. I, I love it. I want to get one myself. <laughs> in real Christmas life. Life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. You're getting into your stamping, aren't you? You're enjoying it. Love, love, love stamping. Yeah. It's quite therapeutic. It is. Mm. It's nice. Yeah. It really takes you out of the rest of the world for a bit. Yeah. And just. Let your imagination run wild. Yeah. Oh dear. It always makes me nervous when you come on here with me. <laughs> no. Yeah, unpredictable. <laughs> oh, nice. That is lovely. That is nice. It is lovely. Okie dokie. Right. So, we're going to accessorise it now, which I... I really enjoy doing. It's just mm. being a little bit creative and putting your own take on it. So we've got some little lamps, we've got mushrooms here. Um, so yeah, I mean you could even put foliage on the top. You can do whatever you mm. want, you know, just be, use your imagination. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> here we go. I said that to you. And given the freedom now. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to start with some little dinky mushrooms here. Um, and twilight. So I'm going to ink up in twilight. Going to get a little acorn. Oh gosh, okay. <laughs> We're back with the acorns. Back with the acorns. And the fur. <laughs> right. More mushrooms. Mushrooms down there as well. 
Okay, so a bit of melt in. I'm going to pop that up there, I reckon. Just wiping off because I don't want to get that bit. And then I'm going to pop the other lamp down here. You can tell what my favourite subject was in school. I just, I just, I, I get so absorbed into creating art though. I yeah. was never an academic, never. No. In fact, you're more academic than what I, that me or your dad was, to be yeah. honest. But um, no, I was never interested in anything but just drawing. Just drawing. Yeah. I'd be drawn oh, in my really. bedroom when I was like young and I can remember mum always shouting upstairs, Trays, Trays, you need to eat something. <laughs> like two hours later, Trays, come on, eat something, you've not eaten anything all day. Because <laughs> she gets so absorbed there, yeah. in doing, you, you know, art. And time just, just flies. It just takes you to a different place. Yeah, you just don't even think about anything else, do no, you? No, not at all. The twilight. twilight is okay. yours. So, <laughs> right, I'm going to put a little one of our little lamps here as well. I think that might look nice. We've got one of those as well. Sorry, I'm just concentrating. <laughs> <laughs> that might be a bit too much though, a bit too close. That one, I've, I've got an idea. Have you? Can I have it like just there? Do actually because we're cutting around this anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm hoping so. Well, yes, so. that, that, yeah, <laughs> um, that's up to you though, okay. Right, yeah. I'm gonna use black for that. Mm. Is this what colors are that? Now these come in a set, don't they? They there's two of them, I think. Yes, there is two of them. Yes, uh, I'm just using the small one. Oh, do you like that? we sport for choices here. There's, there's too many options. I know. <laughs> I don't know which one to stamp. I know. Did you see that card that um, Mona did? Oh, and she put think, um, and, uh, like everything on it, which is not something I would normally do. No. But it was absolutely amazing, even down to the mermaid's tail in, yeah, in the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She created this whole scene of the pumpkin underwater. And was, I, I, we were all really like in, so impressed here, stunning. weren't we? It, it was, was yeah, it, just it something was, different that I wouldn't normally have done. No, no. But then that's the beauty of having the design team because they're all unique, aren't they? All they all have their own they're ideas. They've all got their own style and completely different as well, which is um, which is great. It encourages you to be you, doesn't it? Yeah. Completely. It does. I know that hasn't come out, but don't fret over it. It's fine. We can Not just even a little bit of a slant and everything. It's looking great to so that. No, it's fine. It's alright. What you could do is use Colour your it. stencil brush and blend in that corner to make it dark. That's uh, what I would yeah, do. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. Okay. Right. I've got to think now. Put my thinking cap on. What am I going to do now? <laughs> <laughs> what happened to oh can I borrow the elements orange? Thank you. And what I might do is just colour that in a little bit more, make the pumpkin stand out. Oh yes. You read my mind. It needs to just pop out now, so yeah. we've got to bring in a little bit more colour. Hmm. And it's amazing how just that bit of colour just makes it into a solid image. Sorry. Are you pinching mine? No. I would never. So I'm going to make it slightly darker at the edges and, oh, light, and lighter in the middle. 3D? Yeah. Nice. Painting with a or drawing with a paintbrush. It's quite difficult. Are you drawing? <laughs> Painting. 
actually try that brush might be easier I think that's a, that's one for literally doing such a fine line oh, okay. so you wouldn't use that in that instant I'm just grabbing another paintbrush so you know the long one yeah is just for literally doing a long line right but for filling in oh, yeah, just get a, much. yeah quicker and it's a slightly fatter brush so We'll probably go over that with a bit of Posca pen as well. So you can have that if you want. Thank you. I'm going to think about what colour I'm going to paint the lamp now. Um, what colour should we do? I might actually do that blue at all again. I quite like that. It's a really nice colour. But blue is your favourite colour. Blue is my favourite colour. You're not wrong. Oh, it's quite bright blue. Over the yellow though, it goes quite green, quite a green oh, blue. Oh, that's really nice. It's like a turquoise yeah, orange. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Nice. Okay. Yes. Oh, well, I like that. Just going over the edge a little bit, just to give it a bit of shadow. I have brown elements, henna. Have a look over there. The sound of better in henna and truffle. Um, what are you planning on doing? Painting the sign. Where are you painting it? Oh no. Because uh, of the words? Oh yeah, maybe just the bit of the stick. i tell you something you could do. I do like the corners. Tell me something you could do. Mm -hmm. And I am going to take over here because you won't know go. what I mean. If you get water, what you could do is go over the top with the water. It's, it's just dirty water, it doesn't really matter. Because your VersaFine is actually an oil based ink, it won't budge. No matter how mm. much water you put on over the top um but what water does over the top of the elements it forms it to the surface oh so it intensifies it no, no you can actually bleach it out you oh see? yeah yeah so it makes your sign stand out that little bit more but you really need to pull the water on you can't just put a little bit you really need to pull it on yeah. Okay. You see how much that stands out now? Way more. So the longer you leave the water on, the more it will bleach out. So, um, yeah. Okay, I think that looks good now. Well, it, you know, it, it's clearer. Yeah. And it's made, made it sort of 3D, yeah, made it stand yeah, out yeah, a bit. Yeah, definitely. Well, what, the other thing you could do, just, you know, shall I have a go for you? Do what? <laughs> All I was going to do is you could go around the sign very, very lightly, That's light like colour. So I'm going to do that with the pumpkin now. And I'm just going to go around the edge. And again, it makes it just pop out. Yeah? Mm. So you could do that with your signs, yeah. go around the edge. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Which one was I? This one. It's um, all about building depth into it. Yeah. What colour do you want? The Emperor Red, please. <laughs> okay. Okay. I didn't want to give you an option because I knew you wouldn't give me this colour. <laughs> well, you go for it. You'll see. <laughs> this is the yeah. bit you enjoy most, isn't it? <laughs> it just makes me nervous, but it's fine. Do you know what? It's your card. It's your card. You do whatever you like. Don't worry about me being just a control freak. <laughs> is, it, is this one you gave me before? Yeah, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 
I'm liking those colours, they're nice. Hmm. I'm going to go a little bit darker though. So I've got, oh, I've got Midnight Blue here, another one of our new colours, which is a real sort of the darkest purple. It almost looks black until you see it in the light and there's a and hint the, of purple yeah. in. Have you seen that? Yeah. This this one is literally midnight blue is like a, a the darkest blue is purple, isn't it? It's not just black though as it looks. No, no, you it, get it into the light. You do see the colour. You can see the colour. Yeah, absolutely. Look at this. <laughs> Look at the evil. It's nice. How cool is that? That is nice. Yeah. It's, it's an evil carriage. <laughs> it's going to steal all the fairies. So what am I calling you, Leonardo? Yeah, Jamie Da Vinci. <laughs> I like painting with elements. Yeah. Probably something that not many really think to do. No, it isn't, is it? But it's a really good technique. It is a good technique and you get shade, real yeah, definition from yeah, it as yeah, well. Definitely. Definitely. Mm. Definitely. Definitely definition. Sorry, I'm leaning across. Which one do you want? Can I share the lid of that? Please? You can have that now. Yes, thank you. You're very welcome. The elements have gone down well with our customers as well, haven't they? Yeah, yeah, looks like they will. I'm already thinking about the next lot. <coughs> next lot of colours. It's never enough colours. Never enough no. colours. Well, I think how many colours in the world there are. I know. you off for leaving the lids off and I'm leaving them. <clears throat> right, I think I'm going to put a few little words on and about. Um, what colour should I go with? I might actually go with that very faintly. Chianti. Hey. Happy days. You like it. This. That was shading. Incredible. <laughs> Incredible. Love it. Um, hmm. What other kind of colour? Hmm. Oh, have we got a yellow element? Yes, we do. You want some yellow? Sahara. What are you using yellow for? We're on the sign. Oh, okay. Maybe. You could try it. You might know. want something. Oh no! Bit... Sorry, the yellow is for here. Mm, ink a yellow ink over an orange. You'd probably be better off with a Posca pen. Okay. Um, because it's more opaque. Um, think about watercolors. Is you 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 can't get layers so much. Yeah. No. Okay. So. I'll just get some fine as well. I might just put a bit of white on the table and just pick that up. Because with Posca you can paint, you know, as well. Just need to add a little bit of water. All I'm going to do is just highlight a few little areas. Holding your breath. Oh no, I'm really... Concentrating here. <laughs> I'm going to put a few dots about now. I quite like painting as well. You said that a minute ago. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really so, enjoying painting. It's good. We're getting to talk now. We're getting so engrossed in what we're doing. We're not even speaking to anybody. 
Oh, our poor customers <laughs> gone into complete silence. Sorry guys, I was just completely taken away then. I forgot we were even. <laughs> I know, we did actually. I was just enjoying making it. Enjoying the moment. <laughs> yeah, no, we were. Um, okay, Posca's, yes. Bit of Posca magic. Bit of Posca. You've got loads of different colours there. A red? Uh, yeah, I've got um, a really bright yeah. orange or a Dark red. red. Yeah. So. Right, how do we do this again? Right, give me a shake. Are you going to? Yeah. Okay. So you need to get the back of a stencil brush, yeah? And just... Okay, I've got it. Yeah? Is it coming through? Um. Right. Glitter. And then that was the it. other thing. I don't really know why like this, but one. we're doing this. Oh, a lot of breath now. That's because you've held your breath again. <laughs> <laughs> It's intense, this crafting. <laughs> I'm liking that. I'll just get the raspberry for this. There you go. Thank you. I've got a little bit of green stickles down at the bottom. Yeah, I like that. I'm done. I'm happy. I'm happy with that. We've got like a blue one of these. Oh, yeah, the sparkly Cayman, please. That's a lovely colour, though. Very, very nice. I haven't, I haven't used that before, and then I used it the other day, and now I can't stop <laughs> using it. <laughs> You're too tall. I know. <laughs> Or I'm too short. Just a bit, don't it? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I should stand on something. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Are you happy? Yeah, I think so. Cool. That's nice. Oh, a bit of green as well. I like the idea of the ground. You see my grass here? It's great, isn't it? You enjoyed that, haven't you? Thoroughly <laughs> I really enjoyed it. <laughs> I'm going to find you in my office probably at 7 o'clock yeah. tomorrow morning, aren't I? A secret crafter. A bit of sparkle though, it's amazing what a bit of sparkle does. Those it just brings it to life, really doesn't does. it? Do you want to darken that corner or are you happy? Um, it might just be a bit faded. Like, you know, just Absolutely. worn over time, wasn't it? That's fine. You need to get the fairies to come out and fix it. <laughs> Okie dokie, right, there we go. Are we happy? Oh, I'm really happy. Should we cut them down? Or... Yeah, we can cut them down. I'll go and cut them down. Oh, thank you. You can, go, you can carry on talking. Well, guys, what's your favourite stamp in this new release? Um, I'll tell you what, this pumpkin cart has to be mine and I think with the elements it has to be the I think the blue at all is my favorite but again I am biased by blue <laughs> what's your favorite there you go oh, thank, oh yes it looks better doesn't it now it's all days. cut down I like it Coolio. some of my favorite ones that or cool beans. Cool beans. Say. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for joining us again. Yes. Um, and hope. thanks for your patience while yeah. we've kind of rambled <laughs> on about nothing. I hope you've enjoyed today. And we um, hope we've you had some fun. Yes, we've had some great fun with this.
And we hope you enjoy the stamps. Yes. And I hope it's inspired them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's see your versions on of these <laughs> online. Share them with us. Yeah. We want to see. Yeah. Thanks, guys. You take care. And we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye. It's not. Oh. I, I really like that. Yeah, it's lovely. <laughs> it is really nice. The